In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can get Shopify's one-page checkout on your store today. Now, if you don't know what the one-page checkout is, it's a new feature from Shopify, and it's really good because it simplifies the checkout process for customers. And this will lead to increased conversions and sales. A study by Baymard found that 69% of shoppers abandon their carts before completing the checkout process. A one-page checkout can help reduce cart abandonment by making it easier and faster for customers to check out. So let's jump into it. I'm going to show you exactly how you can add this to your store right now. So to start with, you first want to be on Shopify and we just want to head into the settings, which we can find in the bottom left corner. Once we've selected that, we want to head over to checkout, which we can find right here. And there is actually two ways to see if you can add this to your store yet, because this is this feature isn't rolled out to everyone yet. It is only to select people. But regardless whether you have access to Shopify's one page checkout or not, I'm going to still show you how to get a one page checkout, even if you're not eligible. So if you are eligible, there was, there's two ways to check. The first way would be to look here. And if you are eligible, you will see a banner which will say there is a new update about the one page checkout. And it will ask if you want to update your site to the one page checkout. Now, if you can't see that, don't worry, you might still be eligible. But what you're going to have to do is select this customized checkout button here. And then what we want to do is scroll to the bottom. And if you are eligible, there'll be a new setting right here around where checkout settings are. And it will be called checkout layout. So there'll be two options. There'll be the free page checkout, like you can see here. It goes from information to shipping to payment. And then if you select that, you will actually have the chance to change it to the one page checkout. So if you do go ahead and choose a one page checkout, it will offer a better experience. It's shorter, faster and friction free. So this will be better for your customers overall. Now, what do you do if you're not eligible? You can either wait a month or two and this will be rolled out to everyone. Or if you don't want to wait that long, we can actually do this using third party apps. So if you were to do it using third party apps, you'd have to back out of this and go over to your apps. So if you did want to do this with a third party app, I would recommend typing in something like one page checkout. And then you can look and see which one's for you. I can see here this one offers one click checkout, Cartly. You can see that this one offers one click checkout. So it could be worth checking this app out and seeing how good it actually is and seeing how the one page checkout actually looks. And if it does look good and you think it would increase your in conversions, then it could be a really good idea to set this up. So hopefully you did manage to add Shopify's one page checkout to your store. If you did, you're going to boost your conversions loads and sell a lot more products as a result of that. So if you did find this video helpful, please comment down below to say that this video helped you out and like and subscribe for more content like this. Thank you for watching.